Breaking news. APC loses more lawmakers to PDP in a do. Hello, my wonderful people. The problem of what is going on in PDP Edo State is not a today story. It started a long time ago when Adam Sushomole was still the APC uh, NWC chairman. As at that time, Adam Sushomole, you know, thought the sky was the limit. But actually, the sky is really the starting point, is not the limit. When Adam Sushomole was told by a chairman in a, a, his local government that um, what is happening right now, you know, and so the thing graduated to himself and Obaseki and um, I mean, a lot, a lot of water went down that bridge on a, on a more serious note and uh, to the extent that Obaseki was disqualified from APC, he had to pick up PDP uh, party membership ticket at the very last minute. And like they say, the rest is history. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, subscribe if this is your first time. APC in Edo State is still fighting Governor Gordon Obaseki even after the glary win by INEC announcement that Obaseki won it with over with about uh, 300 and something uh, you know votes as compared to 80 something thousand votes. Anyway guys let's get straight into the news. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up subscribe if this is your first time. Breaking news APC loses more lawmakers to PDP in Edo State. The All Progressive Congress APC Edo State has lost two members of the House of Assembly. The two lawmakers are the former Deputy Speaker of the House of Assembly representing Akoko Edo Yinka reporting as our correspondent. Yekini Idaye and members representing Oro Romowo East constituency Honorable Nosa Okubo. Speaking of the House, Right Honorable Marcos, Speaker of the House, I beg your pardon, Speaker of the House, Right Honorable Marcos, during the House sitting on Monday, read their letters of resignation from APC to the floor during the House section. According to Yekini letter, May, may I use this medium to inform you of my resignation as a member of APC? I took the decision because of internal crisis in the party from my ward to the local government level, which led to the faction of the party for some time now. It is on this note that I have decided to resign my membership of the APC and officially deflect to the People Democratic Party. Honorable Nusa Sleta reads, This is to formally inform you of my decision to resign my membership of the All Progressive Congress APC. The decision is equal to the division within the party, which has become irretrievable. I have made tremendous efforts to ensure that this division within the party is reconciled in line with the provision of the party constitution, but to no avail as the leadership of the party has simply refused to allow the issue involved to be adjusted for the peace to roll on. Consequently, I have no other option than to resign my membership as a learned colleague, uh, and I know what is best instead of enslaving myself in a place where there is rancor. Nosa, Welk, Nosa also spoke about his deflection to the People Democratic Party. The Speaker of the House also welcomed the lawmaker of the People Democratic Party, commended their desire to work for the state's governor in making Edo great again. Meanwhile, the House adopted a resolution calling on the State Commissioner of Police and other relevant security agencies to address the manic of armed hoodlums unleashing terror in Oromo War East west and other parts of the state currently as we speak so this is what is happening apc in edo state is actually bleeding you know because of the whole activity that stemmed from the disagreement between adam sushomole and governor godwin obaseki i mean it it, it, it became so much that and, and the whole of it 
in the process, Adam Sushumole lost his position because the chairman at that time, Aslam, is now, uh, 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 is now a member of the People Democratic Party. He was the one that said to Oshomole, you are suspended. And Oshomole took it with levity. The one who told him and Oshomole took it, you know, took it for granted. And that was how other people who were not happy with Oshomole's leadership style, you know, capitalized on it and it became a full-blown issue all so much so that courts got involved and at the length and breadth of it Oshomole NWC was disbanded. Today what we have in APC is a critical committee that decides and sees to the affairs the day-to-day -day running of APC. So what's, what, what, what are we talking about? APC and those states have two parties in fact, the recognized one is not even APC, it's Edo People's Movement, which is a different party on its own. And that is why everybody is asking what exactly is going on in Edo APC. Because the truth of the matter is, at the end of the day, you know, APC is still in court with Obaseki over the September 19th victory and has sprayed the court a number of times to disqualify Obaseki and to instill the APC uh, candidates. So right now, APC in Edo State, uh, we know that um, when the former chairman, after the uh, the critical committee, this you know destabilized the whole structure of APC, you know, and made them all critical committees. Uh, you know, right now we know that the faction that was not recognized as the critical committee chairman has all moved to People Democratic Party. On that move, they did not just move, the move alone. The chairman moved with over 150 members of the of APC party into the People Democratic Party. And don't forget that currently, as we speak, APC is doing a membership re re revalidation, membership exercise currently going on in Edo State. It is a time for members to decide and to say effectively who, what, what area, who they stands for. And, you know, all this started from Oshomole, you know, uh, in, 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 insisting on his position that he, you know, he, he owes the center of APC in Edo State. Obaseki resisted him and like they say, the rest is history. Today, what we have in Edo State is factioned APC. So members have left so members are still there and, you know, uh, it's, it's a long way ahead. We'll keep you informed as the matter unfolds, but we just want you to know that APC Edo State has a long way to go. Leave us a comment. Let's hear your thoughts. Please don't forget to like us. Please share, subscribe, click on the notification button. God bless you. Have a fantastic day. Bye for now.